I illiterate, uh, I'm a uh, daughter of illiterate Dalit parents. And uh, I'm also the first generation educated uh, person from my family. Uh, and because of that, uh, we also face so many issues. Uh, and in my childhood, also I faced so many uh, caste related issues. And I also saw everywhere uh, the persons from my community are attacked. And nowadays I realized that that is not only in any village, that is everywhere in India, especially UP and uh, other states, surrounding states like uh, uh, Udra, Udrahan. Uh, that such cases are uh, not a, a huge number, but in UP and Delhi and so many Bihar and so many states, this type of uh, uh, issues are uh, day to day, it's increasing. And uh, I think, uh, you all are uh, knows the real situation of uh, Dalit, Adivasi, and other marginalized, marginalized women in India facing so many issues. They are fa fa facing uh, two types of discriminations. One is based on their gender, and another is based on their religion or their caste. And uh, we all are su uh, suffering from uh, economic uh, issues and uh, some other social issues and sexual uh, atrocities and also caste-based atrocities. And uh, we in everywhere, in education, in, in our profession, in everywhere, this type of discriminations we all are facing. And uh, another thing is that, uh, uh, also uh, introduced that I am one of the first women to enter Shabarimala. And I think because of that, uh, I am here. Uh, and after 2nd uh, January 2019, I faced many issues. And I'm also targeted by Sangha Parivar group. So many, so many groups, RSS, BJP, and Karma Samadhi, and so many Sangha Parivar groups, okay? And they are all, all, always trying to attack me and uh, some other ladies like uh, Rehna Fatima and Bindu Tengan Kalyani and Libby Sears. So many women uh, were attacked by these groups and physically and in cyber cyberspace. Uh, I, I think I, I am the uh, first woman uh, to uh, attack here, uh, not in first, in, in, in case of a number, okay, uh, the first to the attack, cyber attacks facing by these groups and uh, uh, they are also uh, created morphed videos, spawn videos and uh, uh, they in, in, in cyberspace, in uh, Facebook and WhatsApp, in all cyberspace, they, uh, they are spreading uh, this by, this, this is not by a person, single person, this is a, and it's an organized crime. The, at most of the atrocities of, uh, 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 against this uh, marginalized sections are always done by organized groups. That is also uh, show we, we that's proved in Billy by cases. In that case, also we we all seen so, so that uh, uh, it's a it's a targeted uh, groups and uh, they are they, they they are always spreading hate politics and they are always uh, uh, trying to this uh, attack against minority groups. Uh, especially women, and in this case also um, uh, online mock auction, and this is uh, 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 done by uh, some some uh, some, uh, some groups of Hindutva, and uh, we know that actually the meaning of the word Hindu is way of life. But nowadays we know that uh, they are trying in India, uh, BJP and uh, other RSS and other groups all are trying try, trying to become a Hindu Rashtra. They all are trying to spoil our constitution, destroy our constitution, our constitutional moralities. The Indian constitution provides so many rights, equality and also protective discrimination and religious rights. But nowadays we all, uh, I, 
in, in everywhere in schools colleges in uh, in our profession in our in our course in any every workspace and uh, including domestic space they are trying to interfere our old rights like uh, our uh, our op actually we know that uh, the food habits of uh, uh, we, we have we, we, in india is a multi ethnic multicultural multi linguistic country but uh, hindu hindutva uh, organizations and also states state is also trying to interfere our food habits and our old rights uh, including our uh, dressing and our, our right to food and in oh, in everywhere they are trying to interfere and curtail our constitutional rights and our uh, customary rights and they all are trying to destroy the dalits and the adivasis and the muslim especially women's rights and they they are trying to become india become a hindu rashtra and they are also inter, trying to introduce hindu code but uh, i think in india as uh, uniform civil code is a good one but at the same time we all uh, we know that this is a multi ethnic multicultural multilinguistic nation so it is not easy but at the same time they are trying they are they are not trying to become a uniform civil code but they are trying to become a hindu civil code and so we all are against that we 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 thought india you know is a soci socialist country and democratic country but uh, in india they are nowadays uh, in, in the occasion of 100 years of uh, uh, rss uh, uh, anniversary they are trying to india become a hindu rashtra and so they are destroy all democratic principles practiced in india and uh, we we the people women dalits and adivasis we we are uh, never allow them to create india become a hindu rashtra we are trying to protect our rights we are trying to protect our constitution and uh, uh, yesterday is international women's day uh, uh, we are here in kerala uh, here at vayana district we constitute we we, we inaugurate uh, a she point that's a space for women and so uh, we, we 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 develop it become a good library for uh, these uh, uh, women and also that that space uh, this space exclusively for women and we all uh, we all trying to uh, unite and we all trying to uh, work together and uh, in the occasion of this international women's day uh, my message is we all work together and we all provide better supporting system uh, without supporting better supporting system we can do nothing okay so uh, this is my uh, message and my request to international community to provide better supporting system to all marginal, marginalized sections Uh, especially uh, adivasi dalit and women dalit women and also all other minority sections and uh, uh, this occasion i appreciate uh, you uh, here wearing of this hijab and this is also a uh, i think so amazing okay uh, I, I, basically i am not a muslim but uh, nobody is uh, this uh, this is also we provide a supporting uh, uh, sub, it's also a supporting system and we, we we all we all recognize and we all are trying to uh, fight against this hindutva state and we all trying to fight against all hindutva groups and uh, so this is a good initiative and i appreciate you all thank you